Today we have a federal working group that's come to visit Archer. And it's really exciting because the Biden administration signed a bill to really help work to bring and safely integrate eVTOLs in today's airspace. This is a really important day for Archer because it's a chance for us to show the progress we're making and really how close the industry is to coming to market. Thanks for being here, everybody. The aircraft you see in the distance is called Maker. This is our demonstrator aircraft. We've been flying it for the last year and a half, gathering data that we use in the certification process and development of our piloted four passenger aircraft that you'll see when we head over to the hangar later today. Everything we're doing here is all very real, very tangible, and based on technology that's available today. We're building a piloted plus four passenger vehicle that will look and smell very much like part 23 airplanes that you see today. But we do have an electric powertrain and that's one of the primary differences. We want everyone to see these vehicles and be inspired. Archer has a couple really big partners. The first one, United Airlines. They're buying aircraft from us, but they also help us work hand in hand with the airports, trying to figure out how to integrate these vehicles into everyday use. Our second big partner is Stellantis. Think Jeep, Ram, Dodge, Chrysler one of the biggest automakers in the world. They've been a huge partner in helping us think through manufacturing. What we are here to explain is that there is a new low noise safe vehicle that can enter into service using technology that's available today and really start to help move the industry towards this new sustainable form of aviation. And that's exciting.